early next day, the team take me to a special place. Six months ago, a warden found a Siamese crocodile's nest. It's the only one they found in two whole years of searching. The team were elated. No. <laughs> they checked the precious eggs and let nature take its course. Aloha. All species of crocodile are surprisingly caring mothers. They dig out nests and guard their eggs fiercely. When they hatch, the babies call to their mother and she carries them carefully to the water. Oh, here we are, Edith. Oh, wow. But for this mother, something went wrong. What happened with this? Um, with this nest? Unfortunately, some monitor lizards Oh, no. came and, um, and ate all the eggs. Then no, no babies came out after that. So you lost how many potential Cambodian crocodiles here? Well, this, this oh, nest 20. had, uh, I think, 25 eggs in it. Oh. So it's, uh, it's a bit of a loss, yeah, for sure. That's a huge loss. It is. When you consider there's maybe, well, we think maybe fewer than 250 adults left in the world in the wild. Yeah. Um, possibly considerably less. This could. You know, this would have really helped bump up mm. the numbers. I didn't realise how badly losing the nest had affected everybody. If they could fund more wardens like Mr Coote, the team could find and protect more crucial nests. After this disappointment, Mr Coote's got more positive news. Another crocodile's been seen in the area. This is um, pretty much going to be our last chance to see the crocs. Um, we're heading down to the lake, hence why we've got to be quiet. So we're going to go, go down there and um, just hang out and fingers crossed we see her. Sometimes if you make the sound of a baby crocodile, yeah. she's going to think that the baby's in distress and will come and okay. try and rescue it. And there's a chance we might be able to glimpse her. So this is the noise the baby makes when it's upset. time spent waiting, watching. And the reason being is because there's so few of them. But just now we've been sat here for ages, not a sign of one. We haven't seen the crocodiles. After a long walk back, it's up to me to lift our spirits on my last night at camp. As I'm from Scotland, I've brought them some gifts from Scotland. So I brought you some shortbread, and some biscuits, yeah. and more importantly, whiskey. A little bit, yeah, just swig a little bit. Good morning. Good? Good, good. Yeah? Good. Come on! <laughs>